So this is my own 2001. Actually, I bought it in January 2001. Uh, A4B5. And uh, what is special about this car is that I have been the only owner since I bought it. So it's been in my hands and all the kilometers and everything on it I've done myself. So. This car is really close to my heart and although I am driving all these new Audis like the R8 and RS6 and RS7 and all this, I always find this car very unique. Uh, I do own an RS4 B5 as well and uh, I bought it last year and uh, yeah uh, I wanted to tell you a little bit about this car and it's a 2001 uh, A4 B5, which is actually tuned and styled by myself, how I wanted it to look like. And basically, I wanted it to look like a tuned A4. I never wanted it to look like an, uh, a, you know, an S4, an RS4. I wanted people you know, to see it as a clean style A4. So as you can see, uh, I do have uh, aftermarket uh, tail lights, but uh, I think they look good because uh, they do not differ that much from the original ones, and uh, uh, you know they do look kind of standard, and I like them. I like them a lot. So we do have a um, character uh, rear lip. Uh, we do have a Simon's exhaust system. We do have a JE design rear wing. We do have uh, 19 inch RS6 wheels with uh, Votex side skirts, tinted windows, uh, aluminum uh, mirrors. And front is very special because uh, you see, this is a Votex lip actually that is merged into a standard. Uh, bumper so we have merged it and uh, you know it looks different it looks good it looks sporty we do have this front grill which is uh, yeah own made it's from an all road and I made it myself to match together with an RS4 grill uh, the BSR mark right here is uh, the company that is that has tuned this car uh, and this car has 300 horsepower right now. Uh, it's the standard 1.8 turbo that is uh, 150 horsepower from beginning and right now it has 300 so yeah it's quite a lot. Unfortunately it's no quattro so compared to my almost 500 horsepower RS4 there's a huge difference so uh, yeah it struggles quite much with the grip. Uh, and what have I done to the engine? Uh, well, let's open it. You know, you know, won't see much because it's. I wanted it to look like it's stuck, but it isn't. So let's see. There we go. We have a huge turbo from ATP down there. Uh, we have a modified data box. We have the stage 2 plus plus from BSR. We have the three uh, three inch front pipes and um, uh, Especially made inlet hose and Yeah, Simon sports exhaust all the way back sport cats Yeah, and it goes as heck. I love this car and uh, Yeah, I would never ever sell it Never. I will keep it until uh, I'm 90. Uh, it has only got 90,000 kilometers actually. So in 15 years I've done uh, 90,000 kilometers and every single one of them is my own. So uh, yeah, um, I'm thinking what more to say about this car in this one take right here. Um, oh yeah, I do have xenon lights both in the uh, normal lights and then the fog lights so yeah and the color is Santorin blue by the way oh yeah and uh, one thing I forgot all the videos that you s 
for example the a4 b5 led uh, um, demonstration that you can see on the youtube i think they've been uploaded there for like 10 years uh, this is the car so the a4 b5 led uh, demonstration volume one and two which is i think seen in hundreds and thousands of views through the years this is this car so long time ago i did have led lights on it from the front but um now that I uh, look at the car with the stock lights, I'm thinking to myself, what on earth was I thinking? But it was something new. The R8 came with the LED lights and the A5 came with the LED lights in 2007. It was, it was something new and I think I was, I was the first one that had those LED lights on an A4. So, yeah, that was then. This is now. Let's see if we can start it up and uh, maybe go for a little drive. As you can see, I have the aluminum rings around the meters. I do have a Momo gear shift knob. Well, it's nothing special compared to my RS4, but here's a, um, what do you call it? Let's see. The gauge that measures the turbo pressure. Belt people, buckle up always. Let's see if you can hear a little bit. I love the psh. Whoops, gravel, not a good way to go with 19 inch wheels with a low profile tire. So there you go. This is how it looks and yep, that's it. love the sound because it's not too loud when you just drive normally but when you do floor it it sings beautifully yeah and um, the color by the way I've been uh, it has never been winter driven so that's why it looks so great and uh, I've always washed it with my own hands never in the machine or something and uh, I think if you give uh, much love to the car I think uh, you can see it you know you can see it on you how the car looks and often when owners show up their, their rides you can actually see the love put in the car and I think you see it in this one because it's really if there is any scratch on it I know exactly where it came from but um, yeah so I hope you enjoyed this short one take video I will show you my RS4 B5 that is so special I'm working on a very special video of it and also my unique Q5 with over 300 horsepower so yeah thanks for watching guys